main powers, trolley, central controller, signal repeater, pickup, monitoring sensor, headset, charging system, equipment operation. Step 1. Turn on the switch of the central controller. Enter the starting interface. Click Enter. The system prompts to switch on signal repeater and wireless monitoring sensor. Step 2. Turn on the power switch of the signal repeater. The green indicator light is on. The power display bar starts. Step 3. Turn on the power switches of all monitoring sensors. The green indicator light is on. Step 4. Click the Next Step button in the Operation Interface to enter the parameter setting. Set the corresponding parameters such as surroundings, soil layer, pipe material based on the site environment. The gain and the field terrain will be automatically adjusted based on the corresponding parameter setting. Step 5. Click the connecting status. The monitoring sensor icon is blue and flashing along with the received signal, indicating that the monitoring sensor is connected. Step 6. Start to analyze. Place all the monitoring sensors on the ground above the tested pipeline. Step 7. Click the starting analysis button in the operation surface. Each monitoring sensor will start automatic analysis. Step 8. Click to enter the analysis result interface after completing 30 seconds of automatic analysis. The location with the highest signal bar indicates that the monitoring sensor is closest to the leakage point. Click the abnormal blue icon of the monitoring sensor. The corresponding red light of the monitoring sensor is flashing. From these, the suspected water leakage area is determined. Step 9. Place the other monitoring sensors around the monitoring sensor with the right light flashing one by one. Follow the same method as steps 7 and 8. Find the position with the highest signal bar, then click the abnormal blue icon of the monitoring sensor. The red light of the corresponding monitoring sensor is flashing. The location of the suspected water leakage can be determined. At the same time, the sound collected by the monitoring sensor can also be used for analysis by using the headset. Introduce the detection method in the condition that the pipeline distribution is unknown. Place the monitoring sensors around within the measured range based on the matrix placement method. If each signal bar is low with basically the same height in the analysis result interface, it indicates that there is no water leakage nearby. Continue to mirror other places based on the matrix placement method. In the analysis result interface, if the signal bar is abnormal high, it indicates that there is water leakage nearby. Click the abnormal blue icon of the monitoring sensor. The corresponding monitoring sensor prompts by red indicator flashing. From these, the suspected water leakage area can be determined. Place the other monitoring sensors around the monitoring sensor with the red light flashing using a rain placement method one by one. Find the bar with the highest position on the screen. Click the abnormal blue icon of the monitoring sensor. The corresponding red indicator of the monitoring sensor is flashing, indicating the location of the suspected water leakage can be determined. Data export and view. Click the export button in the analysis results interface. Export the collected results data. Click View. Double-click the picture to view the exported analysis result. Click the icon of the monitoring sensor in the location of the suspected water leakage. Click Record. Click Stop. After completing up the record, the sound of the water leakage is automatically saved. Click Replay. 
display the corresponding recording file. Notice. Prohibit to be used in flammable and explosive areas. Please handle the monitoring sensor gently. Cooperation produced by Hunan Puchi, Water Environment Institute, and Hunan Puchi, Geologic Exploration Equipment Institute. Service hotline plus 86 731 8223 7112.